Today's Praise in Peril devotional thought is two ropes. But without faith, it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh to God must believe that he is, and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. This devotional is based on Hebrews 11 verse 6. 2020 was the year we thought we wouldn't have survived. It was filled with so many challenges and twists, but God saw us through. I am positive that we all had great plans and our expectations were high. However, some were derailed. Hallelujah! The work of God continued because He is in control. The world went on lockdown, but not the gospel. The message of a crucified Lord went across the world like a wildfire, thanks to technology. Amidst all the crucibles, there were two ropes that kept the children of God faith and hope. Failures will come. We will have struggles. We will experience loss. Doubts will assail us, but we should never let go. We should hold fast to these two strong ropes. Hope is indispensable to our existence. We need it to survive. Faith begins where our power ends. We need it to please God. Whatever comes our way, we should have faith in God and trust the process. The book Steps to Christ says it beautifully. We have nothing in ourselves of which to boast. We have no ground for self-exaltation. Our only ground of hope is in the righteousness of Christ imparted into us and in that wrought by his holy spirit working in and through us he alone abides in our hearts by faith to learn faith one must endure great trials we will learn strong faith by standing amidst severe testings let us keep holding on to these two main ropes firstly we must keep our feet firmly implanted on the ground secondly Keep our eyes steadfast on the Lord. Lastly, remembering at all times that these two ropes will never fail because God will never fail. He promises never to leave nor forsake his own. Trust these two ropes because they have worked in the past and I am confident that they will continue to work for us today. Faith and hope are the ropes which anchor us in Christ. This was your Praise in Peril devotional thought written by Derma Virgo from the Port Antonio SDA Church and I am Ronald Douglas.